Hey! Help me! If you leave, these snakes will kill me! Get me out of here! Snakes. Nah. Blessed be the god that sent you here. I'd have been eaten alive if it weren't for you. I don't think they'd eat you. But they would have certainly killed me. So thank you. I'm always happy to help someone in need. The world could do with more like you, especially now. Pericles sent me. He was worried about you. Do you often get tied up and surrounded by snakes? How can you joke about this? Thugs broke into my home, dragged me here, tied me up and surrounded me with these hideous creatures. They must be stopped. The snakes? The thugs! Why would anyone do this? Politicians are easy targets in these troubled times. When they tied me up, they said I was a snake. That I should die by my own kind. Did you recognize the people who did this? Pericles asked me to go down to the fishing district and talk with the poor and sick to give them hope. That's how I recognized their voices. Oh, yes. They threw rotten food and yelled insults at me. These thugs disguised their faces, but their voices and the stench of fish were unmistakable. Where should I look? I couldn't see their faces, but I recognized their voices from one of the districts I visited. They're regulars at Cleon's rallies. They live in the flooded part of the city, near the wall. I'll track them down, Metiochos. Don't worry. Tensions are high right now. At this rate, we'll tear each other apart within the city, before the Spartans can breach the walls. The part of Athens I doubt Pericles is proud to talk about. Like the ones that were meant to kill Metiochos. It looks like the thugs who attacked Metiochos weren't the masterminds behind this plot. Hmm, snake bites. And someone hid the body. Though I have a feeling this death was an accident. This must be the house of Metiochos' attackers. But the letter proves they're just tools in someone else's plan. Whose? What the fuck are you doing sniffing around my house? You attacked Metiochos. I found the snakes, the letter from your friend, and a body. All here. Ah, oh, poor Actis. We all knew the risks. Chains don't happen without a bit of blood being spilled. I know someone gave you those snakes. They used you to do their dirty work. I want to know who. He's a real hero of Athens. No puppet of Pericles is going to stop him. Don't be someone's puppet. Tell me where the snake dealer is. All right, all right. He's got a camp just outside the walls. Sells his snakes from there. You've crossed the line. Now you must pay the price. We will never surrender to the likes of you. We will make Athens great again. The corrupt will be snuffed out one way or another. I need to rid Athens of this snake seller. I should try to stay out of sight. Yeah, 
monsters over there! You'll feel the sting of my venom! Friends of Pericles safe. <clears throat> Looks like your situation's improved since we last met. The danger has passed for now. But while those monsters are out there, no one is safe. A group of fishermen tied you up. They were being used by a snake dealer working for enemies of Athens. What did you do with them? I gave them what the gods demanded. Justice. The punishment seems fair. Still, it pains me to see sons and daughters of Athens turning against one another. They tried to kill you. If I hadn't arrived when I did, they would have succeeded. Thank you for your help, Mistios. I'll be sure to mention it to Pericles. <gasps> uh. 